the complete song of Hummingbird, once slow and then faster. version. First of all, it's beautiful at a slow tempo and it really doesn't have to be fast. So if you feel that you get out of control, especially here, that's kind of the gauge. If you, get, if you can't keep it even as you get faster, then don't go faster. <laughs> um, or if you want to make it a goal, it's actually the wrist that's going to allow you to go faster. The more this is loose, just um, you can practice on your lap just dribbling a ping pong ball kind of an action where your elbow is, uh, I hate to say locked, but that really is, it's just where it is and it's just all the movements coming from your wrist. It's that kind of a motion, but more of a roll up. But it's very loose. So the more loose it can be, the faster it can do this. If it locks up, then that's when you have problems. So that's kind of the key. Um, and then the last thing is the pedaling I didn't tell you how to do. Um, it kind of uses the same harmony throughout this kind of watery magical combination of C major plus the D sharp and the F sharp added in. That's mostly what it's using. Um, and so it can just blur. It's just it's supposed to be blurry. So whenever you want to clear the pedal, go ahead and clear the pedal. At the ending though, it is kind of nice when you do that motif. You've had all of this. together under one pedal or keep the pedal down and then change it on the end. They both have a nice you know touch to them. I could really one or the other might win out for me at different times. So and then the last challenge you can do it slow, you can do it fast or you can improvise your own version. So just remember you have the hummingbird motif do that anywhere on the piano and you could do it as many times as you want so you could you know change it up you have the swoop down motif with the G swoop down to the C so there's that and that's a nice one that can you know and then you could start that where we put it together into the arpeggio there's that also element that building block pressing over So just make something your own. Um, go up and down as much as you want. Do things as many times as you want. And just see what you come up with. And then somehow end with C major. 